In March 2022, the RAFs and the Royal Navy's Hawk T-1 single quote S made their last flight from Kudros. Based out of Royal Navy Air Station Kudros at Helston, the jets have been involved in training Royal Navy and NATO ships in air defense for decades, and have been in service with the RAF for 40 years, but that has not been their only role. Hawk T-1 jets are also the same aircraft used by the hugely popular Red Arrows display team, whose aerobatics with colored smoke have delighted generations. This has raised the question with some of what the future of the display team will be once the jets are taken out of service. The good news is, however, that while the black RAF and Royal Navy jets will no longer be seen in the skies, the Red Arrows are to remain. Passing on the official line, a spokesperson for Royal Air Station Kuldros told the packet, the Red Arrows are officially known as the Royal Air Force Aerobatic Team. The drawdown of the Hawk T-1 will not impact the Red Arrows, who will continue to fly the Hawk T-1. Flying British-built fast jets, the Red Arrows are renowned as one of the world's best, and most recognizable, display teams. The Red Arrows are regarded as a great British brand and often perform at major national occasions. The B-Systems Hawks have been used by the RAF for 40 years and the Royal Navy's aircraft date from the 1990s. They were first based at Royal Naval Air Station Kildros in 1994 and were incorporated into the reformed 736 Naval Air Squadron in 2013. It was announced in the integrated review last year that the Hawk T-1 was to be retired, with the decision that 736 Naval Air Squadron at Kildros would be decommissioned. Lieutenant Commander Jason Flintham, the commanding officer of 736 Naval Air Squadron, said, It has to be acknowledged that this is a sad day for everyone involved with the Hawks but we should not lose sight of the significant contribution these aircraft have made to defense. Watch this video of the Hawk T-1 doing a final flyover before retirement. As always thank you for watching, it is sad to see these amazing aircraft retire but you can still see them flying with the Red Arrows. Subscribe for more content and good night.